The month of March is Ghana month and we are putting extra efforts to promote Ghanaian products. And so the traditional kente cloth is desired in the wardrobe of many across Ghana and beyond. But the laborious kente weaving process contributes to the high cost of the cloth on the market, putting it out of the reach of many. There are, however, innovations to support indigenous weavers to produce faster without breaking their back. In this report, Ibrahim Abubakar explores the potentials of innovatively weaving kinti to increase profitability and satisfy market needs. Kente is a traditional cloth woven by the Ashantes and the Evers. The important cloth is worn for important and memorable occasions. It is woven in narrow stripes on a narrow horizontal loom, usually using two to four sets of heddles before being sewn together to make a wider piece of cloth. It takes weavers months before putting together a cloth. Bonyre in the Jesu municipality of the Ashanti region is synonymous with kente production. Over 70% of residents here depend solely on the production and sale of the traditional cloth. Other products like bags, slippers, wristbands and neckties are also produced from kente. Local and international tourists visit Bonyre to observe the weaving processes and also transact business with producers. Although almost half of the Bonyre town roads have been tarred, roads leading to tourist attraction sites are currently not in good shape. This, according to producers, discourages potential tourists and buyers. The price of a kente cloth ranges between 150 and 300,000 cities or more depending on the complexity of the design. Though the traditional method of weaving brings out the uniqueness of the cloth, the process is tedious, taking several hours to weave a narrow stripe. This sometimes discourages the youth to fully engage in the business. But a mechanical engineering student at the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology has manufactured an indigenous automated weaving machine to ease the burden of weavers. Ebenezer supervisor, Dr. Yosun Yagbe Fiagbe says the machine will drastically reduce the time of weaving. 